Hey everybody, it's Ryzen51 here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Shantae and the Pirate's Curse. Uh, we've been progressing through Propeller Town lately, and we are going to continue on doing that some more. Um, surprised I'm actually recording today, because, well... Unfortunately, I had to take the day off, because... Because, uh, simply say, uh, bad weather... That has taken effect yet again in my area because of uh, icy roads, pretty much. I was literally trying to go to work today, and, uh, no kidding, I was literally something slightly like crazy. It was absolutely insane. Ugh. I was literally had, like, a few situations where I thought I was actually going to crash, but, no, nah, I'll save though, honestly. Mm, that is a little scary, speaking of which, right there, of how tight that was. Oh boy, that was nerve-wracking. Oh, okay, sorry about that. I'm answer a message real quick. Alright, anyway, uh, let's proceed on. But, oh, uh, yeah, it was, it was really scary out there, so... I just had to let them know I couldn't come in today, so... I just couldn't take that risk on crashing or something happening to me out there. Pretty much anyone else that's on the road, period. Ready and ready to go today, but no. After that, I cannot take that risk. Alright. I think I'm gonna go up here. Oh, I can't. That's right. I need the uh, cannon jump for that one. Oh. Okay, you. Oh, nice. Got pipe ball. That good. I'm glad I didn't let that drop. Hey, Bolo. Thanks, sir. Took care of me, Shante. You're working for Techno Baron? Sure, why not? I got glasses. You said look super smart, so you may be his assistant. Someone finally appreciates me. I feel like I'm on top of the world. Well, yeah. We're a thousand feet in the air. Look, I don't want to mess up on my first day. I just put the final touches on this doohickey. So let's get the Animal Baron back to Skull Town. Delbert says it's super important. What to do? I don't know. So what? You're a friend. You always have been. I can count you, right? Here, take it. We got the target module. Okay. Thank you, Polo. We'll be on our way. Um, I think there is something here we can get real quick. Boots at least make it a little easier to get through. Yikes! Oh, and you can't jump for that one. Okay, never mind. Time to fall down safely. I don't want to risk anything happening. Um. Ah, shit! <laughs> I didn't see that so now. <laughs> Oh, okay, thanks for me to the left there. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, no, fuck. Okay, do I have a pirate fire on me? Okay, I got plenty. Yeah, please. <laughs> I thought I was close to the ground. <laughs> Whoopsie. Alright, let's head back. <laughs> that was funny. Uh, wait. No, I missed one cackle bad then. Oh, okay, it must be inside the dungeon. But we haven't found a single uh, heart slit there. Wow. That is surprising. Yeah, these messages just keep popping up now, nowhere. Okay. Let me go uh, heal up a little bit since I did take some damage. That's better. Alright. <sighs> um, I should probably go back to that place and grind up some, some gems. There's not really much I can buy here. No, not at all. <laughs> oh well, what can you do? Oh, damn it. Alright, let's try it again. Hope if I can keep going without having more interruptions, but... That's only just one chat with me, but... Timing. <laughs> Target module, can I have it? Sure. Wink. <laughs> I'll grab faster next time. Do it again! 
Oh, is this the same thing? Oh, okay. They need to do it a few times, then you just get a trophy for this. Uh, we'll go ahead and give it to him. Okay, Hammond. Trophy Mojo has arrived. That's awesome. Pow! Good work, citizen. Yeah, yeah, here you go. You jerk. Where are those new recruits? Still at the palace, I bet. Oh, right. Um, hmm. Actually, I don't remember there is something I can go do right now. I think I need to do this in order to progress the story a little more. Let's head back to Tanline Island. Because there actually is something now to do with the risky... Well, I don't have the risky boots on. Or risky boots. That joke is never going to get old. Let's just charge on in. Oh! Damn, I was hoping to actually hit her right there. Okay. Here we go, let's go. So many damn bats and skeletons, jeez. Got a couple of pipe balls and super pipe balls. Free money. Here we go. And now we have the enchanted blade. Thank you. I thought there was something else we could have done. <clears throat> More pipe balls, thank you. Alright, I'm gonna cut to where I get to the other side of the area. I'll meet you guys over there. Actually, let me kill you first. Thank you. Alright, I'll meet you guys over there. <clears throat> Alright, found the place. Uh, I think it past the temple. You want to head down here. Because this area will have where you need to do the... Uh, use Risky's Boots. To help you get to the... Next... Uh, this little area here. Right, this guy up. Oh, shit. He's going to spawn him. Damn it. Alright. Here we go. And this leads you to your other Kekko Bad. Slipless said... Oh, you really stay up there? Okay. I thought you were gonna fly down or something. Oh, no, come on, Eric. Do the sexy dance. That's better. Sexy, sexy dance, Shantae. <laughs> Alright, we got the dark magic now. So it puts us up to 14 now. And leads us back out here. Okay, good. Alright, I think we're good now, so let's go ahead and use our pirate flare. Alright, we got what we need. So we can go ahead and return to uh, Skull Town now. Give our man the enchanted blaze so he can be a hero again and such. So there's some missing three cackle bats in this area. Wow, we. Oh shit, I hesitated. Oh. Did it again. Right. Here we go. Just gotta watch out for those pits. Don't wanna fall into those. Whoop. Pardon me. Pass it by. Oh, and here we can make a little shortcut now. Makes things so much easier. Whoop. Hiya. Uh... Is that... Is that the Enchanted Blade? You found it? Here you go. So we got the blade now, so he's all set. Sorry, I want to close my door real quick. <clears throat> my blade. Now that I have it, I better make myself scarce. I'm pretty sure my good friend Berenson is about to make a sudden appearance. Oh, gosh. Shh. He's going to say the words. Hey, guys. We should go get matching purses. No reason they should be just for ladies anymore. Am I right? Hey, fellas, don't leave. Fellas, come back! Seriously, those are the words. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so stupid. It's, it's Branson! Shout your bell cry! I gave... <laughs> I gave the advantage. <laughs> Thank you, E-Man. <laughs> I had the power. God damn it. 
<laughs> now then, only a trio of others are priming to my deception. The bald enchantress, man with guns, and the hob mage. And now me four. Right, four. Together we protect Castle Boneface from the uncalled legions of the Grim Reaper's ghosts. Uh, your bitches sound kinda cooler than mine. They are, and I'm also an excellent role model. I'm not. On account of my bad temper and outlandish outfit. Just remember, kid. It's not what's on the outside, like skin and hair. It's what's on the inside that counts. A kind heart and blood in your guts. That's what makes the whole body go round. Thanks. That means a lot, Brandon. Who's Brandon? Knock it off. You're the same guy, just with a jazzy halter top. Oh, okay. Show, show's over. Get going. Remember, tell the truth and be true. To yourself. Aw, sweet, we saw it. Yep, the Grand Reaper's Ghost will pay good money for this info. Let's head back to Animal Baron before he knows we're missing. See, girlfriend. What? Those the girls from Slime Island? You are for the Animal Baron? Okay. Well, uh, that was fun. But, uh, we really should be taking our leave, so... Be right back, everybody. Alright, made it back. No, 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 no need to use risky boots thing or anything. Kapow! We're all set! Thanks, Early. Glad you find us that joined join the wave team. Um Look, I even drew my own fan art of how your Animal Town uniform would look. That's small. Pew pew! But first, I've got other bits to take care of. Let's run down the checklist. Power maximum. Aye, sir. Firing station. Finger on the trigger. And you're sure the target module is installed properly? She's up, up to code. It's a going, not gonna miss. I mean, it's not gonna hit the target, right? Absolutely. She's locked on the pal, sir. Wait, stop! You can't do this! There are people in the palace. You're gonna offend those mobile bur miraculous That's hard to say. Uh, bureaucratic <laughs> busybodies. <laughs> Damn, that was a hard to say. I'm sorry. If they survive, I'll give them new jobs right here on the new second land HQ. Arr, 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 arr. No! Fire on my mark. Three, two, one. Firing Palace Disruptor Cannon! Uh oh. Ah, fresh cool air. The smell of victory fills my vape nostrils. When the Animal Baron destroys Second Lamp House, I'll become incredibly wealthy. Even beyond my wildest dreams. I'll create weapons even more terrible than before. Soon the real power in Second Lamp will be mine. Or will, will be me. Me! The Techno Baron. That's one chubby green bird. <laughs> I love that every time. Oh, that was too funny. Well, this opened up a new dungeon, though. Oh, report! Shot fired successfully, sir. Yes, but... The Anchorite Tark was destroyed. What?! We fired over a second land palace. And blew a hole right through Frostbite Island. Who's responsible for this nightmare? Dark module so up right as rain. Then how? Problem's right here. That's right, there's the main circuit panel. She's installed backwards. And upside down. And inside out. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> hmm. Must have been whoever engineered the thing. Oh my gosh, bubble seat today! How long till we get fire cat fire again? Go need to get a new module. Last, somebody find the Tendo Baron. I'm not telling him. Hmm, maybe it's time I checked out that hole. That'd probably be best. Since um they're on hold right now. Till um for instructions. <laughs> Oh, that guy 
Nice. <laughs> now we have X. Now we can do some more stuff at uh, Frostbite Night. Okay. Alright, let's go. We at least get started with the dungeon. Oh, crap. Well, you know what? I'll do this way. I can still get to the area like this as well. Oh, jeez. I hate that. Those walls can lead to, like, at least uh, a heart and a half of health. They can do some nasty damage. Here's the hole. Alright, Bandit Factory. This is, uh, the final dungeon in the game. The fifth and final one. I mean, there will be one more to do afterwards, but... Um, well, I'm gonna start with this right now. Let me get a little bit started in this one. I meant to run. I meant to wait. For the platform to come, not jump all or walk off. Good job, stupid good job. Go ahead and get the. Can I get the. Thank you. Just want to get the hearts here. Alright. We'll keep going. We can go a little further. Uh, we can't get set up here, but I'm going to wait. We're well, going to have to wait till we get our. Uh, 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 our uh, particular item we need for this dungeon. Which is, which is the cannon jump. Right, the platforms that uh, fate that uh, disappear. This isn't really that bad. I mean, it's just the other side of the way. That's about it. But overall, it's not really that bad. All right, and we got our key. Thank you. All right, now we just gotta make our way back. I saw you, fella. I don't think I didn't notice you there. Risky hat does make does save you some time. It makes it things a little easier. <clears throat> All right, let's move on. Whoa! Forgot about these guys. You two take one hit, but uh, you can't explode in a. Uh, Still trying to damage it at the same time, but it's suicidal a bit. Oh yeah, those guys can still hurt you too, apparently. I wasn't sure if they could or not, but now I remember that they do. Alright, here we go. Good deal. Oh, damn, I thought you were dead. Oh shit. And now they're a little odd creatures here to fight, but yeah. Ah, no! Don't you touch me! How dare you? Bubble shield. Okay. Bubble shield will actually will be uh, very helpful for the boss or about the one we fight here. Not this part, but the next one. But it will be very helpful. I think this will actually be a good place to stop right now since we saved. And we made um, some progress through here. Mm, decent progress. <clears throat> Alright, so next time, everybody, we are going to finish up the abandoned factory. And then we'll see what else we can do then throughout the episode. So, we are getting closer to the end. I'm not exactly sure how long do we reach the finale. Um. I want to see me three parts, probably. Three or four more parts, we should be close. So we're getting closer to the of Pirate's Curse. We'll see what happens. I'll see you over the next episode. Till then, later, folks.